Hello there. Welcome to Woodset Central. I'd like to give you a, another update on the new loco yard I've been building. We've uh, made some significant progress now. Track is laid. Uh, most of the wiring is completed. And apart from one point motor, which I'm waiting to uh, receive from the supplier, all the points are in and motorized. I've reprogrammed my ECOS uh, with a new map which I'll show you in a moment so that I can actually operate all the points and the turntable from the ECOS unit. Okay well let's have a look at what I've been doing. So the new loco yard starts at this point with a feed from the main line area. This is brought in to the track just behind the diesel multiple unit sheds that are on the layout. If we pan round a little, we bring the turntable into view with its various feeds coming round a little further. We can see the various roads into the new engine shed which is located over to the right hand side of the layout. So this is the map on my ECOS unit and that acts as a touchpad where I can by selecting points I can touch them and they will actually change. Now I've created a new section for the local yard and you can see here is the turntable with the various points radiating off of it and that's the feed into the new engine shed and various other sidings that we've created. I've still got uh, a lot of work to do at this end of the layout. Obviously there's the ballasting of the tracks and I also want to put some walkthroughs into the engine shed. Typical concrete walkthroughs. So uh, that's work that's all to be done. And we'll then need to fence off the area which is actually the locomotive depot to uh, keep out the members of the public. I'm planning an access road down this side of the engine shed which will uh, come into a yard car park area for the people who actually work at the motive power unit. The loco unit's uh, a very nice backman four lane unit it's very well detailed and very well made. I'm very pleased with it, albeit a little bit expensive.
Well, I hope you've enjoyed this short update. Coming up to Christmas, I'd like to take this opportunity of wishing all my subscribers a very Merry Christmas and all the best for the new year. I hope you get the uh, trains, track and rolling stock that you're looking forward to. Anyway, have a nice Christmas. Happy New Year for 2020. I'll no doubt catch up with you then. Bye for now. And if you haven't subscribed, um, perhaps you'd like to. Thank you. Bye bye.